what she's doing. Uh, right, um, <clears throat> what I wanted to say is, I did start my meal plan today, but because obviously I did my scratch card video first, I didn't have enough memory for it, so I had to delete what I've done today, so, sorry about that, but, so, what? I'll, the only thing I've got left to do is just dinner, so, I'm going to do one of the meals from the new Take 5 book, because I'm absolutely loving this uh, Take 5 book, I think it's absolutely brilliant, and there's quite a lot of meals that I actually want to do in this book, so, I'm going to do them as I go along, so today it's going to be steak and mushrooms, so that's what I'm going to do, I'm going to give you a quick peek of the book and then I'm going to get going with it, I think, this is going to take a while, I think, obviously the chips, the Slimming World chips will take a bit of a while, so let's get going. So guys, here is obviously the meal book, and obviously steak and mushrooms, right, I have swapped some of the ingredients because some of the ingredients I don't like. So, I'm not having um, sweet potato, I'm going to have Slim Royal chips instead. Uh, I'm not having uh, green beans, I'm going to have curly kale. Obviously I've got my steak, I've got my mushrooms and I'm not having that either. But I'm probably going to have the steak, the mushrooms, chips. I might have some beans as well to go with it. So I'm just going to give this a go now. I mean... We all know how to do steak and chips, but I'm just going to get cracking with it. Right, guys. So, I've got my potatoes for my chips. Here's my steak. Um, I've got my mushrooms as well here. I'm going to have big ones. I'm actually going to cook them as they are, so the big ones. I'm not going to have as many as the book shows. I think the book shows, what, five? I will not have five. And obviously... Curly kale. That is, I do actually like curly kale to be quite honest. So I'm going to start chopping up the, obviously the little chips, because the chips take longer than usual. So I'm gonna make a start on these first. So yeah, I've just, just got a few potatoes. I mean, I don't like the big potatoes because, like, I never use them all. So I thought I'd get the little bag of salad potatoes. I think it's easier for me. And I think this is plenty here, just with these. And I will put some chip seasoning on it as well to give it some extra flavour because I like the seasoning. I've got to try the JD one actually, I haven't, I haven't tried the JD one yet, so, so what you do, you just slice them in half. I weren't going to do um, a food vlog today because I thought you guys would get bored of it, but I thought let me do one because I know most of my uh, regular viewers, they do like the cooking and the meal and the meals I do so I thought I don't want to let them down so I'm just going to quickly do this for you guys my regulars you know who you are always messaging me is there a vlog today a cooking one so like I said I've been getting right into that Riverdale TV show and you know what I think it's absolutely brilliant I'm actually getting attached to that TV show and I hear that there's going to be a new season coming October this year 10th of October right so right they're done I've just got to get the active fire out now this all I'm going to have to move the little uh, little chippies out of the way Fire plugged in. It's a big beast, isn't it? Um, I, I do want to get a new one. Um, I think I'm going to get an air fryer. Morrison's do it, and it's uh, about thirty pounds at the moment. So, guys, this is going to be the chip seasoning that I'm using. So, uh, I need a bit of fry light as well. So there you go, guys. I've got to spray the chippies. 
And then a bit of this sprinkle of this. That'll do. And, and on it goes. So I'm gonna have to start raising my voice now while that's cooking. So next step is going to be cutting up the meat. So if we were gonna swap weights now, and just turn around here to the other side of the kitchen. There we go. So, how many of you guys, how do you like your steak? Let me know, I'd like to know. I like mine exactly how the book shows it. So, like I said, this does not take long at all to do. Because obviously, well, first of all, I've got to cut off the, I'm going to have two steaks actually. Uh, I need to cut off the fat because obviously, obviously we're not allowed to add the fat. So let's get that fat off. I feel like I need a, a bit out of a sharper knife. This should do. Look at that, perfect. So we're just going to go around the edge. So you can have any meat, as long as you cut the fat off, the meat would be sin free. So that's one steak done. So we'll do the second one now, and I'll tell you what, this does smell, it feels weird. I like cooking, sometimes I've got to be in the mood for it really. So, aren't you guys lucky getting two vlogs out of me today, eh? Right, so the meat's done, I'm going to set that aside. Because I'm going to start to get the kale on the go. Well, get the water going. Uh, how long does this take? The cow takes 12 minutes, not long at all. So the book is saying... So guys, the book is saying that we need to fry light both sides of the steak and the mushrooms. So I'm just going to do what the book says. Turn them over. It's not saying that I would normally do, but I'm just following the recipe. So turn those steaks over. And uh, I like mine in like a medium slash rare. So it says here, cook three minutes each side for a medium and four minutes each side for well done. So I think I'm gonna do mine for a well done, I think. So that's the fire light sorted, so I'm going to be having three, mu three big mushrooms, two steaks, I'm going to go all in the griddle pan, with some chips, curly cow and some baked mains. Do you know what, I think this is going to be a really good dinner. Good, because I'm absolutely starving. Right, so just got to wait on the chips now, get, get those going a bit longer and then we are good to go. So guys, I just added the curly cow in the boiling water. So I'm going to cook that for about 8 minutes on a high. Um, I've just sprayed the griddle pan with fry light. I'm going to heat that on a high now as well. And then I'll start cooking the mushrooms and the steaks. So I might have to do it in batches. So I might do one steak. Well, actually, I'll do the steaks first and then I'll do the mushrooms. Because the mushrooms do not take that long. So, dinner is nearly done already. That's what I like about this meal. Doesn't take long to do. Just got the beans ready, I'm gonna stick those in the microwave. So, that's in the microwave ready, so let's make a start on the steak. How many mushrooms do you think I could fit on here? Might be able to get the three. Just about, look at that, perfect. So what's that about? What? 
four minutes maybe from now. Let's uh, get the extractor fan on. Get that window open. Well, it's starting to smell nice, ain't it? Well, I suppose you would be able to smell, would you? So the, I'm going to go for like, I don't know, like three minutes each side. So we've got the fan on, we've got this timer on as well. Chips coming along all right. Let's have a sneak peek at the steak. Looking alright. Turn those mushrooms over pretty soon. So look on the kale. So a bit steamy there guys. Kale's coming along alright. Lovely jubbly. So I'll just flip the mushrooms over now, so they're starting to look alright. I think they're pretty much done in a minute. The steaks are coming along as well. Yeah, looking alright. A bit longer. Well guys, so the mushrooms are done. So I'm going to flip the steaks over now. That's it, that's exactly how I like it. Four minutes and that should be good. Mushrooms look good too. Chips are coming along great as well. Stick those beans on for a couple of minutes. Looks like the cad is good to go as well. Can't wait to taste this. I'll tell you. Guys, and there you have it. So, we got two steaks. Slimming World Chips, Baked Beans, Curly Cow, and Free Mushrooms. I mean, okay, it, it's not what the book said, obviously, but I don't like sweet potato. I'm not keen on green beans. So, you know, I, I made some swaps. So, you know, I swapped chips, Slimming World Chips for sweet potato. I swapped green beans for Curly Cow. And I swapped the gar, what, what, what's this, uh, rosemary for baked beans, which I thought was good swappings. So, you know, so I got my uh, steak, chips, mushrooms. Well, they call it steak and mushrooms, but I'll class that as steak and chips. So this is my uh, steak and chips from the New Take 5 book. And I'm now gonna tuck in with that with a nice can of Diet Coke. Well, guys, all I've got to say is that was the bomb. Tell you what, that was very tasty. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Nothing left on the plate. Now, if you guys like that kind of meal, I think you should do it. I mean, it's really nice. I mean, it didn't cost a lot either. I mean, I got two lots of meat plus another lot in um, <coughs> excuse me in um, Asda, two for seven quid. I mean, that's easily four meals. So, I mean, fairly cheap. You know, potatoes don't cost much. Beans, a bit, you know, some mushrooms. You know what I mean? It's, like I said, really easy, cheap. So, um, yeah, make it if you want to. Recipe's there, pretty easy. Um, 
and that's it really so that's the end of my vlog so i hope you enjoyed the video please give the video a big thumbs up if you haven't subscribed please subscribe stay tuned to see more recipes have a good evening take care bye